Namaste. Honorable First Minister of Wales, Right Honorable Mr. Mark Drakeford, Honorary Consul General of India, Mr. Raj Kumar Agarwal. It is a great honor for me indeed to come to you today virtually to extend the warm greetings of the people of India to the people of Wales on the occasion of St. David's Day. The National Day of Wales on March the 1st has been celebrated across the globe for centuries and in Wales we join all communities in celebrating this very special occasion. This year of course we are guided by the priority of health safety and safe distancing but this has not apparently diminished the Welsh spirit. We are aware that this year is especially important as the Wales government highlights its five-year international strategy designed to promote Wales on the international stage and showcase its vast progressing economy, increasing exports and opportunities for inward investment. Wales is indeed on our radar. We consider it to be a responsible nation committed to internationalism and its rallying call to do the small things is indeed inspiring. This is very much in consonance with a key message of Mahatma Gandhi, who we Indians revere as father of our nation. He had said, man becomes great exactly in the degree in which he works for the welfare of his fellow men. As India and the United Kingdom, just like every other nation in the world, grapple with the impact of the COVID-19 pandemic, we have raced against time and worked together to see how best we can cope and help each other and help other countries in the world to overcome the crisis. We also share with the United Kingdom and Wales a deep commitment to global efforts to address climate change. The high level India-Wales dialogue in this regard on preparation for a very successful COP26 are examples of our cooperation in this vital area. Indeed, it is the small things that each one of us can do individually, joining the effort of community and nation and the world that will make all the difference. So as we look forward to initiatives and joint activity in the coming days, I wish the people of Wales a very happy St. David's Day. Dave Goyal, Devi Hapis,